Hello everybody, this is Dr. Geeta Matai and this is my Health Vibes channel. Today we will talk about a very common problem. It is called either PCOD or PCOS, Polycystic Ovarian Syndrome or Polycystic Ovarian Disease where multiple cysts are present in the ovaries. What happens to these women? When they are young girls, they are very beautiful. Then when they mature, all of a sudden they put on weight, they develop pimples, the hair on their head falls off, they develop a hairy face and worst of all, their periods become very very irregular. These poor girls are not able to plan their life or decide what they are going to do because they don't know when their periods will start. It doesn't start for months on end and once it starts, it doesn't stop. They have a very miserable life. Why does this occur? This occurs because the eggs are not released from the ovaries. Every month, one egg has to be re released and has to die for the girl to get her periods. When there is no signal, the uterus does not know what to do. So it just bleeds as it likes. These are cycles without release of the egg or anovulatory cycles. If you look into the family of these girls, there may be many other women with the same problem. There may be a strong family history of diabetes. In short, there is a genetic predisposition. Polycystic ovary, ovarian disease was rare. It was only 1% 100 years ago. Now, almost 10% of the girls have this problem. It, it can be blamed on their inactive lifestyle, their tendency to eat snacks and uh, the many, many other genetic factors. So, in order to control the periods and make sure that you get it every month on the same date, you can take oral contraceptive tablets or OCPs. 21 days on, 7 days off, you will get your periods very very correctly. But at the same time, you will not get pregnant if you take this tablet. So if you decide to get married, the medication has to be changed to medicine which will make your ovaries release the eggs. So stimulatory tablets have to be taken with consulta consultation with your doctor. Now suppose you say to yourself, I do not really want to take all these tablets. They are all hormones and have side effects. Then you can cure your disease with a little bit of effort. Losing as little as 5% of your body weight will make your cycles regular. And how do you do this? You have to be very motivated and exercise for 30 minutes a day. You can go, you can run on the road for 30 minutes, walk on the road or if you are scared to do that, you can go up to your terrace and walk in a figure of eight or run in a figure of eight. If you do not have 30 minutes to spare because the amount of work you have in school, then you can run up and down the stairs continuously for 10 minutes or jog in place for 10 minutes. But remember any sort of exercise has to be combined with a good diet. Do not take a second helping of any food and do not take snacks more often than once a week. With a little bit of effort and training your children, training your daughters to exercise from the age of 3 will prevent them from getting PCOS or PCOD and will also cure their PCOD or PCOS if they get it. This is Dr. Geeta Matai signing off. If you liked my Health Vibes channel, please subscribe by pressing the bell button. If there is any topic you would like me to cover, please write it in the comments column. This video is also available in Tamil. Thank you.